All right, today we're doing a fall styling video. I'm starting with some trouser jeans and almost a matching denim cropped jacket to try to get a jumpsuit kind of look. So I've added a belt, I'm adding a silk scarf around my neck, and then finishing off with some sunglasses and this leather little backpack. And this is the final look for this. I have some black boots on to match with the length of the jeans and honestly very into this all denim look. I'm surprised I was able to make it look close enough to a jumpsuit. Um, they definitely don't match exactly, but I think it works. I don't prefer to wear jumpsuits because they're such a hassle to take on and off. Um, so the idea of being able to wear a jacket instead with jeans is something I'm interested in. <laughs> We're taking the same outfit and styling it a little bit different with a scarf just kind of draped on the shoulders, a burgundy leather bag. I'm adding some jewelry as well. Let's put some earrings in and then also changing the boots out to be my burgundy blundstones. And this is just like a warmer version. So we're adding in some color to that same denim outfit. And I really like this. I, I love adding color in a scarf because that just means you can keep all your neutral basics, but then still play with color in a fun way. That just seems a little more low stakes in terms of adding color to your wardrobe. Burgundy is definitely one of my favorite colors to wear right now. Next, I wanted to try to style this leather jacket that I recently got, and I've been really loving the look of a belted jacket. So I have this metallic belt, and I'm styling it a little cutesy with a feather bag, some silver flats, and this is just like slightly elevated. This jacket is quite oversized, so I feel like it, it overwhelms my body a little bit, so when it's belted, I think... I like what that does and kind of brings it closer to my body form. Next, we've swapped out the pants for a silk skirt and then I also have this suede jacket. Added a little green handbag and I think this is like the perfect go-to outfit for kind of any occasion. I feel like you could go to the office, you could go out for drinks, like it's just like the perfect in-between outfit in terms of casual and formal. Another way to style the suede jacket, I'm doing the belt trick again, but this one's a gold belt and I'm pairing it with some light beige trousers and then of course a little silk scarf in the hair. And then I have this fun crochet bag that I thought would look good with this. I love yellow right now and this is kind of like the only yellow I have in my wardrobe, but I'm loving the yellow and browns together. And I think this little bag is just a little bit of whimsy to kind of a more structured, maybe more office forward kind of silhouette. So I thought that was fun. Next we have a navy pants, navy blazer, and then I'm kind of deciding how i want to wear the boots like do i want to go full equestrian have the boots on top or have the boots underneath the pant and i wound up wanting to cover up the boot a little bit so we went with the boot under the pant i love brown and navy together i think they're just stunning honestly pretty much any <laughs> Most neutral combinations I like, but brown and navy, they just have a richness to them. Of course, belting the blazer because that was just like what I was on for <laughs> this styling. I just wanted to belt all my jackets and I actually really like the way this one came out. It's very Ralph Lauren inspired. I have a little clutch that adds a little bit of color and I think the pink tones work really well with the brown and the navy. Next, we're swapping the jacket out. I have this kind of a gray blue one. I'm adding silver accents, silver lemon pendant, black accessories, um, and I think this outfit's like really sharp. I really love this jacket. I feel like it's like the perfect kind of casual to office wear jacket. 
and it's like the perfect mid-weight kind of jacket so perfect for like 50 to 65 degree weather and the black accessories i think just really sharpen up the look i like the way it looks with the multiple blue layers and then the bit of silver another way to style would be instead to use a scarf over the jacket as a belt and i also really like the way this one looks it's it's definitely more unexpected um, it's wearing the jacket more as a top and I, yeah, I just think it looks pretty cool. Then we're swapping out for a long maxi skirt and I'm trying to go for like a cozy country kind of I live on a farm vibe. So we're going with a cream sweater on top and then we're bringing back that crochet bag for a little whimsy and this is just a cozy outfit. It's not totally my style. It's a little too girly, I don't know, girly country, maybe that's what it is. Um, but I do think it's very cute. Swapping for something that's a little more me, I'm adding my suede jacket back on. Another headscarf because I just feel like scarves add so much to an outfit, especially in the fall. Like, I just think it looks so chic. So this one, I added some more color with red. I like pairing red with burgundy, like analogous colors together, I think are a good way to go if you're kind of unsure how to add color. And I think the suede just makes this skirt so much more fall. Yet another way, I paired my trench coat. It's a wool, navy vintage trench coat. Have um, some black boots on, some black accessories. And then for my statement, I'm just adding a green neck scarf. This outfit is so gorgeous to me and so chic. Like maybe it's just the fit of everything in the long lines. I think it's just really flattering on my shape and uh, just like the long hair, the long coat, the long skirt, like it just, it all really works together. It's quite dramatic with, without being like over the top. Like you have that kind of minimalist style still. So I, I loved that outfit. This was me trying to be um, like relatable wearing a baseball hat. I just think hats look pretty dumb on me most of the time, at least baseball hats, but I like the idea of having a casual outfit, wearing a leather jacket with a skirt and then having it hat on top as like, ooh, I'm maybe I live in New York and I'm walking around. Um, yeah, don't know that it suits me particularly, but I think it's a cool outfit idea. Then I have a silk dress. I love this one. This is from Quince um, and it just like is a perfect one for like work and just out and about. It's not super revealing, but it still has the luxuriousness of silk and I like it paired with this um, cashmere sweater around the waist and then a leather jacket again and then a clutch again if I wanted to make it a little more like evening appropriate. It's just very comfortable. I think it's a, a good piece for fall and super versatile, like tons of different ways to wear that silk dress. I'm styling it now with a cashmere sweater actually on my body <laughs> um, and I've belted it, brought back that really colorful, beautiful cashmere scarf. And this is, again, just a very cozy outfit. If you wanted to elevate this, you could definitely put some heeled boots on, and I think that would look really nice. But I just chose my comfortable Oxfords for this look. Um, I imagine this is like a very like going to work kind of look, so needed to be very comfortable since I walk a lot. Then we're back with the lighter jacket, the silk scarf again around the waist, and this is more of a styling of, you know, like, Mm, a little formal <laughs> you know i have a pearl necklace on and then silver flats and it's just like a casual but formal look it'd be great to like meet parents that kind of thing so that's all my outfits today if you like them please like and subscribe and i will see you next week with another video tschüss